Hello, it's nice to talk to you again, even though it is virtually. Um, I wanted to introduce you to the die kit of the month for April. And here is one that's underway. It's Dyer's Chamomile, which gives the most beautiful egg yolk yellow colour. And this month, for a change, I thought we'd use some cotton uh, yarn. This is a double knit cotton. And the pattern that comes with the kit is to make a crochet shopper bag. But of course you can make anything, um, anything you want with your skein. Um, this is a two stage process. So to start with we have to mordant the yarn. And here's one that has been mordanting overnight. And I have to use aluminium acetate and calcium carbonate which is good old fashioned chalk. And that just helps the colour from the uh, chamomile to stick to the yarn and the fibres. So the way that we make the mordant is simply to put warm water in a kilner jar. Like that, not too hot because you don't want the, the uh, jar to break. And then these will come pre-measured for you in a little sachet. Just tip them out straight into the jar and give them a stir like that. It will be quite cloudy, that's just the chalk. Okay, and then this is the tricky one because the fibre will resist soaking up the water. So you have to be a bit patient in slowly pushing it down and just be a little bit careful because the aluminium acetate um, is a bit vinegary so try not to breathe the fumes if you can help it and then just keep pushing it down I'll leave that one for a bit and then push it a bit later once it's been soaking for about 24 hours and all of the yarn is properly properly soaked tip away as much of that water as you can put more water in again doesn't matter if it's warm or cold just not too hot like that and then you add the dyer's chamomile and this is absolutely beautiful it's a lovely lovely color and um, the smell is amazing it's like uh, the smell of sunshine and sunny hot holidays so we tip it all in and push it down <coughs> idea is to get all of the flowers soaked and resting on the yarn like that top it up with a bit more water if you need to like that. there we go now chamomile gives its color quite quickly I did that one this morning and already the colour is starting to go onto the yarn. So this one probably won't need to be kept in the jar for as long as others. I would say between um, six weeks to two months. So hopefully by the time this lockdown is finished, you'll have got a beautiful coloured yellow skein of yarn and you'll be able to crochet a uh, shopper bag.